everybody, welcome back to the Cloth and Paper channel. My name is Emma, I am in customer service here at Cloth and Paper and also the resident pen nerd, which is why I am so, so excited about unboxing the December 2019 Cloth and Paper Penspiration Box. All right, so let's dive in. Oh, that's always, that's really satisfying, okay. So first up we have the card which points you towards our blog if you'd like to see what else is in the box. Okay, so I did not see the pens as they came into the warehouse. I saw it once they were all together in the little pen pouch and I have to say I think it is so pretty and I can't wait to show you guys. Okay. So that is the pen test card. And there it is. Oh. It just, it looks so good, I think. I, I don't know guys, I just really like this color combination and scheme. I think it's very moving into 2020 and uh, I just really like it and I hope you guys do too. All right, so let's see what's in here. All right, so we'll start with the stuff that I know. This is the Monami Plus Pen 3000. We have put this in the sub box before in lavender. I thought that was a very pretty color, and this is gold brown. Um, shades of gold and variations on gold browns are some of my favorite shades because I think they're so versatile. You can use them in all kinds of like seasons and layouts. Um, so I'm really excited to see what color this is on the page. All right, um, I also know this pen. This is a K508 pen. We have featured this in our box twice before in different colors. So the first time we featured this pen, it was in olive green, and green is my absolute favorite color. Um, and that became one of my favorite pens. And so I also have um, the gray one in my um, everyday pencil case. Um, and so now I get another shade of green and I'm so, Happy, you guys. I think it's it's such a pretty shade. A little backstory on why I really like this pen. All right, so then we've got, I think these pens are so cute. They come in a, a couple different colors, but they all have these frosted caps and they're all light pastel colors and they, they remind me of sort of a, a snowy winter day. So I like that they're in the December box and that we'll be using them in January. Um, these are needle point tipped, um, a 0.38. It's very lightweight, very slim, so this would be a really good pen um, if your planner has a small pen loop. This would be a, a good choice for it. Okay, so you know us, we always like to include a retractable for those of us who are on the go. Um, so, you know, it's our aesthetic. It's transparent. It's black, white, or neutral. It's got a nice clip, and it's gonna be a good writing experience. I think it's a good cloth and paper pen. Um, and this is a conical tip, a 0.5 uh, black gel ink. Okay. And then we have our last pen that comes in this little box. I don't know what it is about unboxing pens, but it just, I really enjoy the experience. And there it is. I love a good matte black pen. I think they are just so classy and I like carrying them and having them. I think they look professional and luxurious. Um, I really like them and I, I actually really like the look of this one a lot. And it's a, it's a very nice kind of matte feel. So we've got the little protector, of course. Um, conical tip. That is a good looking pen. I can't wait to see how that writes. Okay, so now we have the correction tape and I love the way this, this look, that this looks and I can't wait to try it out. Um, but before I do, I have my dreaded nemesis, the packaging. Um, so I think you're probably about to see some editing magic 
in the next minute or two. <laughs> Okay. Okay. I think that was actually only about 45 seconds of me struggling. Okay. Um, I really like the way that this looks because you get that like a complete shape. Um, let's see, I think you just pop off the top like that and there it is. And I believe one of these is, oh, that is so cool. Okay, I didn't know this about this, but guys, this is so cool. So this is white correction tape, and this is ivory correction tape. So I think it's meant to be used if you have ivory or white paper. Oh my gosh, you guys. See, bound notebooks favor ivory paper, and a lot of um, inserts favor white paper. So this is this is gonna be really useful if you have if you go between a bound notebook and um, a, a planner that has more white refills. Okay, so we'll test this out in the closer up when we do the the pen test. I'm really excited about this. Okay. All right, so let us do our pen test with our handy penspiration test sheet. Um, so I am going to start with the Monami Plus Pen 3000 in gold brown. I, I really like a good felt tip pen. I really like the way this color... I really like this color. It's definitely very true to its name. Uh, a brownish gold, um, and I think that would be a really nice accent color. Alright, so then the K508, one of my favorites, needle tip, um, black gel ink, uh, 0.5. Um, and the, the Monami 3000 is a, a point. 3-8 if I am not mistaken, and it is a felt tip. Okay, and this is the emerald green color. Oh, I think it's so pretty. Okay. I have no idea how to pronounce the name of this pen. It is uh, a brand that we have tried before. Um, so I'm going to put white frosty pen. And, and we'll see what the actual name of it is. <laughs> uh, now, if I had to guess, I would say that was 0.38. Let me check to be sure. Yep. Um, so this is black ink and a 0.38. This is going to be very nice for people who, who like a nice fine line. Okay. And then we've got our retractable. Um, I do not know about this one's name yet either. So... Mm, I like the, the nice bold line, so I would say that's a 0.5 as well. Yep, it's right there. <laughs> that's pretty smooth, so that's going to be very nice for people who like a, a smooth writer. Okay, and then of course we'll give our matte black a whirl. Ooh. I like capped pens because I find that very satisfying. <laughs> All right. And this is a uh, black jelly as well. Um, and I believe that there's a refill in here so this can be replaced. Um, we do actually carry this style of refill, so if you prefer uh, a deli, um, that will fit in this pen. Alright. Ah, satisfying click. Okay, and then, I'm, I'm so looking forward to this. Okay, we're going to try the correction tape. Alright, so I'm going to start on the white side since this page is white. Sorry, this is kind of an odd angle, but here we go. We go that's the white and then it just pulled away for a clean and then i kind of just sort of rub off the edges so that they're more level with the page and then we're going to flip it over and 
that is the ivory. All right, I'm gonna just kind of tap it to make sure it's not tape. Yeah, no, that is ivory correction tape. That I, I think that is so, so cool, guys. I'm really excited to have one of these because um, then I can use it for both my journal and my planner um, because my journal has ivory pages and my planner has white pages. So let's see if I can give you kind of a close up here. For watching guys I hope you have enjoyed this video please let me know in the comments below which pens were your favorite for this month and why and also let us know what pens were your favorite for the year and what would you like to see in the Pennspiration box in 2020 bye